Yeah, that's right. Green flag will fly 10 laps tonight for the Hornets. And we'll be Ramirez, Olds, and Bickford to lead them into turn number one. That's how the lineup off of turn number two. Ramirez has about a two-car length advantage over Olds. Olds, they're going to take to the bottom side as Ramirez. This car pushed up the racetrack. He's going to wash off all the way off the track right now, bringing up the dust mites right rear, right front flat for the 88R Ramirez out there on the racetrack. So not too sure if they're running over spike strips or what, but uh, we got three flats the last three races there. Right now it's Tim Olds out front showing the way. Olds has uh, repainted that car once again. There has the uh, the gold HUD caps on that car. As Ramirez does come to a stop off the back straightaway, and uh, he's going to back her in there and do his safer ground by the tractor out there. So we will stay green with Olds right now leading Stephen Bigford. Of course, here with us a few months ago, it was Tim Olds and P.J. Harrow duking it out for the race lead on the race that we had them start out going left-handers only. Then we turned them around and had them making right-hand turns. And it was Tim Olds who got into the back of P.J. Harrow, actually sent him into that tire that you saw Stephen Bickford in 13 just go by there and turn at number one. <laughs> Olds crossed the start-finish line but was DQ'd. As a result, Stephen Bickford was your main event winner that night. And right now it's all Tim Olds out front here in this 10-lap heat race as the cross flags just went up halfway home. Well, that didn't sound too good down there for Bickford in the 13. We'll come back on track as Tim Olds continues to lead. So Tim Olds leads this heat race for the Hornets. Stephen Bickford trying to hang on to the racetrack. And P.J. Hero with a DNS. That's a do not, did not start. And Richard Ramirez with a DNF. That's a did not finish as his car is uh, parked on the back straightaway right now. Uh, might need a little help with the right front flat on his car. And Tim Olds getting ready to uh, possibly put Stephen Bickford one lap down as the white flag flies. <laughs> And Olds will look to the inside of Bickford to put him one lap down as they race in the turn at number three. Olds leading off the bottom side. Bickford going to try to get that one back. Cannot do it, though. Tim Olds will get him down one lap and will also cross the start-finish line as the checkers fly. 